Hey guys, how are you all doing today? So today's video is going to be rather dangerous. We're going to be transferring the Andractinus australis, the uh, Egyptian yellow fat tail that I got. Alrighty, so uh, this is his cage setup right here. Uh, this is uh, chose sand as a substrate because it doesn't hold uh, humidity well, which is really integral because this species likes very dry uh, environments. So what I have is pack sand. Uh, how I got pack sand is that I just bought um, some sand from like Home Depot or Renault or Rona and um, took some out, mixed it with a bit of water, let it dry over the sunlight and uh, there we go, it's packed. So mind you it is really heavy but uh, that's what it's supposed to be so that way it can sustain a burrow. And I added a little small water dish, not very big, just so that uh, she doesn't get dehydrated. Alrighty, so let's do this. Alright, I'm ready. Alrighty, so let's look at the scorpion from this to that. Okay. Now I'm going to prod it. Come on. It's pretty fat, this one. You can definitely see the black tip on the legs, uh, on the on the telson. So it indicates that this is an Australis. Uh, it's a really dangerous scorpion, as I said. Uh, it has been known to kill people. So I'm just getting her out of there. Uh, come on. Uh, so these are really aggressive scorpions and very, very fast. So, uh, do you want to advise caution? And there you go. Oh, that was a uh, easier said than I guess. Yeah, definitely see the yellow body and the black tip on the tail. So hopefully uh, she's going to do well. It's a very big enclosure but I did this for a reason so um, tank maintenance is going to be uh, safe for me. So take this out of there. Ooh, wow, pretty cool. Alright guys, so that's the video. Of transferring the Androctonus australis, the yellow fat tail scorpion, with dangerously potent venom. And I hope you enjoyed it. Alright, guys, thanks for watching.